All right, so we're going to mass once again. I know uh, in the previous episodes I was uh, saying I'm gonna chill out, but when a good deal comes, you kind of gotta go for it. So as you see, we're all trailered up. We're going to mass once again, and uh, we're going uh, very far this time. We're gonna go towards the border of Vermont and New York. So we got what, three hour drive ahead of us. So. Yeah, if you see that setup back there, it kind of looks something like that. But anyway, let's just roll the time lapse and uh, we'll catch you uh, at the guy's house. I'm gonna make sure Corbin records. You good with that? Okay, so we're gonna try to record as much as I can. So let's just get on the road. All right, so here we are. Uh, it's an SS15. It's got the original mower deck. Can you see that? And a, another snowblower attachment. So this one's gonna need some work. Obviously, it needs needs a belt, and then it needs a bunch of stuff. So it's gonna need some, some hardware. Yeah, it's gonna need linkages and stuff. But it's it's there. That's what matters. So um, to be able to find one is hard enough. So to have to physically own two now is pretty awesome. So anyway, this is stuck. This is beautiful. Um, this is probably gonna be my, mo my mower rig now. <laughs> it's loud, so we're gonna get um, get a muffler on that. And uh, yeah, here it is. Oh, show them the original wheel weights. It's got original wheel weights. So that's awesome. So it was a good deal. Look at that in three hours. <laughs> oh yeah, and check out that. So yeah, here it is. Um, we're up to five mowers now six mowers now so <laughs> yay <laughs> so we're gonna just get home it's a long way home we have a little time limit too so we'll just catch you at home we'll update you with more views because they're amazing you probably saw them coming in here so yeah we'll just catch up with you <laughs>
so it is the next morning. Uh, me and Corbin got back and he had to go. He had to go. We had a time limit and he went. So I unloaded everything and there she is over there. So I'll pull her up front here and we'll, uh, I'll uh, tell you what I got. loud as AF. <laughs> Alright, that was perfect. So, <laughs> let's get you off the tripod. So, we have a, the guy uh, actually told me what this is, exactly what it is. So he says this is a 1972 SS15. So, what I love about it and what I, why I wanted it so bad was how original it is. So, it's an SS15, it's got the mower deck, it's got original wheel weights, it's got the chains on it, um, it's got the original engine, it's got the mule drive for the mower deck, it's got, everything works, the engager works, I mowed a little bit with it, everything works, it's got the original engine, it's just, everything's so original with it. So, yeah, that's just, I don't know. When I saw this, I had to have it. Um, he listed it for a really good price, um, so I had to just jump on it and take the <laughs> three hours and 24 minute drive out there. Um, I can show you under the hood. It's got the original exhaust, which needs to go because this thing is loud. So it's, yeah, it's literally just like pipe section. So. Um, I definitely want to change that because it is loud. Um, the lights, I'm going to re-hook up new lights for it because one, this one doesn't work. It works here and there. Um, we're gonna, it looks like we need a new air filter. We'll get a new air filter. And everything on here is just stock besides the battery, obviously. But And yeah, we'll, we'll have to get a new tie down. <laughs> uh, it's got the original guard for that pulley and... It's just everything's there, and the bonus is it came with a snowblower attachment. So, yes, we have not one but two snowblower attachments. So, that's cool. I don't know if that one will go on there or not. Um, it would be nice because it would just work, but I think I have a plan to put it on the other one. So, this one will kind of just stay as is. I mean, sure, it's easy enough to take off the snowblower or. <laughs> take off the mower deck and put on the snow blower. I'm sure it's that easy, but I don't know that. So, and I really don't want to touch it. It's great as is. Um, for some reason, this isn't working. I feel like that should lock it in, but it's relying on that chain and it's got cutouts for different heights, which is funny. Um, but yeah, everything's here. It's all original. Uh, it came a very long way. It came 197 miles over here. So, or 194 something like that almost 200 miles this thing has come a long way so i really really wanted it i really love it um no complaints i finally have my ss15 so so i know in previous videos i was saying i want an st16 which we already have and i want a ss15 which we now have so i will get the whole collection out here to show you what i have so far wally can't really move Wally's chin's axle is out of it right now, getting swapped over. If you want to see that video, um, it will be coming soon, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully, there's no more drawbacks. But um, yeah, let me line these all up, show you everything I got so far, the current haul that I have. Um, and this time I'm really serious. I am done spending money. <laughs> uh, I need to chill out. And I have a vacation coming up, so I want to save up a little bit of money for that. And then, uh, you know, tax return season and all of that comes around probably can't help myself again um, once you find your hobby you really just want to keep investing in it so just because i don't have a lot of money in my bank account doesn't mean i have a lot of overhead now so i have a lot of money in mowers here and they're worth you know they're worth a lot of money right now so if you have one sell it because then i'll come and buy it <laughs> just kidding uh, oh hit me up we got real serious offers i'll come get her so anyway anyway let me get everything out and uh, I'll show you what we have currently.
<laughs> wow. <laughs> Quite the collection here. Um, well, we're missing one more, but... As you can see, they're mostly SS-12s. <laughs> there she is. That one's in the shade a little bit, which is unfortunate. But anyway, there they are. So this is the current collection. So we have Constance, 1969 SS-12, 1972 SS-15 with no name. We have Duro, 1968, 1969, maybe 1970 um, is our current plow rig. Name is Duro. Then we have Stanley, ST-16 with a snowblower attachment. I believe it's a 1974, 1973. And then we have a, uh, gosh, that one's like same era, 70, 71, SS-12, named Wally. So, mud rig, snowblower rig, plow slash future snowblower rig, uh, mower setup, and then I, uh, soon to be um, snow rake, so I'll be good at going in the snow. So this is my current collection, um, and then we got a parts one over there. I guess I could show you. I moved it. <laughs> it's in line now. Okay. All right, so make that six mowers. Phew. But yeah, so technically it's all there. Just missing a dash, I guess. But yeah, this is all the mowers I got. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, there's the haul. <laughs> Soon to be growing. So, SS16, ST16, SS12, SS15, SS12, SS12. So, as you can see, the SS12s are more common. But yeah, here's everything, and that's the current current uh, setup right now so so there it is I haven't had it lined up yet so I'm looking at all of them right now one two three four five of them <laughs> it's actually kind of cool to see here let me show you what I'm seeing with that <laughs> I haven't had them all together so that was just the parts rig but they're all there and then Wally's here so unfortunately I'd love to have Wally up there but anyway there it is um, traveled way too far for it but definitely worth it so got a good deal on it and it's nice to have a lot of original stuff so with that being said thanks guys for watching so hopefully you guys enjoyed that video um it was another another thing i wasn't expecting to go get uh, i kind of just saw it during the week like late during the week and uh hit up corbin was like you want to travel three and a half hours and he said yeah let's go so it was one of those spur of the moment things so but got a good mower out of it so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed and we'll catch you guys in the next one